believe it or not, it's actually a mirror. Huh? This is a mirror? Are you kidding me? It can turn into a real mirror once polished. You might as well believe I can turn into Jude Law. Well, let's find out. To polish the copper plate into a mirror, I've prepared different grades of sandpaper and abrasive paste. First, I use 80 grade sandpaper to remove the surface of Tina and dirt. Seems to help with stress. Let me give it a try. Oh, I give up. Look, it's already shining. Let's keep doing this. It becomes clearer each time you polish it. How can you call it a mirror when you can't even see a reflection huh? in it? What if I do this? Oh, that's a little bit different. Let's use some abrasive paste. My hands are shaking. It shows your excitement. What do you mean? So excited that your hands are shaking. If I keep doing this, I'll cripple my hands before the polishing is done. I'll have to find some tools. Well, I can use my dad. Use your dad? My dad's got electric toothbrush. <laughs> Repeated polishing, a bronze mirror gradually comes into being. More than 2,000 years ago in China, there were already reflective bronze mirrors. With the tools available at the time, the ancient people must have great wisdom and patience. Is it done? Hang on, almost there. Here is the bronze mirror. <laughs>